A new feature in Leopard's Preview is the ability to annotate PDFs. You select, you open a PDF, go to Tools, Annotate, and you can add ovals, rectangles, notes, and links. Also, you can go to Markup and highlight some text, strike through text, and underline text. However, these features, as you can see here, are not available for PNG files. It's a PNG file, and they're all grayed out. However, there is a workaround for this. All you have to do is right click on the toolbar, select customize toolbar, and then drag the annotate button to the toolbar, just like that. Hit return or click on the done button, and there we go. Now, if we want to annotate the image, you click and hold on this, and you can select what you want, oval, rectangle, note, or line. Uh, we'll do line first and you just click and drag and it'll create a line. You can now hit command shift C and change the color of the line. Although note that it has to be selected, these gray circles tell you that's selected. So we make the, our line yellow and we can hit plus and minus to enlarge and shrink the line like that. We can also add a text box. Once again, click and hold in here and select note. Now that we have a note, we will click and drag and it creates a new text note. We can now begin typing and I'm going to type in click this checkbox. Now click and drag on the gray circle. First click on it, then click and drag on the gray circle and you can resize it. And if it's selected, i.e. there are circles, gray circles at the corners, you can hit plus to enlarge the font and minus to shrink the font. Just like the arrow also, you can hit command shift C and pick the color that you want to use for the text. Unfortunately though, you cannot make the text bold or underlined. As you can see from this quick little image I did, there's quite a bit that you can do with this annotation feature, more than just pointing out helpful stuff to people. This has been a video for the Maximal Blog. Thanks for watching and thanks for subscribing.